Dan, I don't have time to socialize, and that makes me feel empty. What should I do? That is the price of success that you have to pay. If you need that emotional support, the validation, chances are you won't make it because it is very lonely when you're pursuing a path, when you are building a business, when you're doing something a little bit different, when you are going a different path compared to most people. In the first five years of my career, when I was building in my 20s, for the first five years, I didn't take a single day off and I didn't socialize at all. I was just working and putting my heads down and just work my face off. Right, I pay the price when all my friends were socializing. Even now, I don't, I don't hang out. I don't hang. Right, I don't chill. I don't. That's not what I do. Doesn't mean you have to be a workaholic, but it does mean in the beginning you have to make choices because in life, every single thing that you choose, there are consequences. It's give and take. You give up something to get something. You cannot say, "Oh, I want to have balance." Forget that shit. I want to. Oh, I want to be able to socialize with my friends and hang out and chill and still. Be very successful. Doesn't work that way. There's a reason why people are successful and why they need to make those sacrifices. If you're not willing, then don't bother. And if you need that emotional support, where I feel a little bit empty, that emotional baseline, the other people to to support me, I forget it. Don't expect other people's support. It is lonely. It is lonely at the top. I can tell you that. It is lonely at the top. It gets lonelier when you are at the spear. First of all, you don't have time. And second, you don't really want to have very shallow, surface-level conversation with people because you feel like other people just dumb. You feel that is a waste of time. You feel like you have nothing in common. That when you're focusing on solving bigger problems, they're focusing on what game it's playing on TV for on, on Saturday night. You know what I mean? It's a different level of conversation. No right or wrong. It's just a different path. So if you have what it takes, you need to learn to be alone without being lonely. You need to learn how to find some new friends. So when you socialize with people, you're actually growing. I think that's a shift that a lot of people have to make, and it's one of the most difficult things that people have to do when they have to get rid of some of the old friends that they have, some of the negative energy drainers and negativity, you know, just negative people around their in in their lives.